Homeless advocates in Corvallis are speaking out against encampment sweeps in city parks. The sweeps are to remove established homeless camps that the city says have become health and safety risks. KEZI 9 News reporter Noah Chavez shows us what advocates would like to see instead of kicking people out. The city of Corvallis and ODOT park sweeps continue Tuesday, removing collections of debris left at Pioneer Park by homeless camps. Of not in all the camps, but some increased use of signs of drug use, um, whether it's needles or burnt foil and things like that. With such a large amount of campers in the area, city leaders felt there was a legitimate health and safety concern for the community and the campers. Um, we've had a number of uh, houseless camps that have been here for probably well over six months. So um, unfortunately with the tall dry grass, it creates a hazard for um, one of the campers. We've had a couple fires down here. But for the many homeless advocates in the area, they felt this sweep is only making the homeless problem worse. But the people who are being swept are still here and don't have anywhere to go. Um, and so in the short term, and there's we're, we're lacking really the short term solutions, I would say, of where can people go that's appropriate for them and their needs that while they're waiting. When speaking with the city and homeless advocates, both agree that this situation is an unfortunate one. With the amount of manpower needed, homeless advocates hope that this shows just how severe the homeless crisis needs to be addressed by the city. Uh, the city really needs to adopt a compassionate policy of ensuring housing as a human right, not a private investment which someone makes money off of. As long as housing is not a human right, then you will have people who don't have housing. It's really simple. There's no amount of housing that you can build. There's no amount of shelters that you can build. There's no amount of affordable whatever. You need to make housing affordable to people who have zero income. I would love if there was a sanctioned camping area for people to be able to camp in because there, like I said, it's a very long time for anyone who's ready and, and has the advocates and the people to work through the housing navigation with them. It, that's still a very long process to wait for. And in the meantime, people need to exist somewhere. So that we need more temporary solutions. Until the sweeps are complete, the groups say they are going to continue offering their services for anyone who needs it. Homeless people die at a rate of three times that of the average Oregonian. So these sweeps are literally killing people, they're costing money, and they're not changing the situation. Reporting in Corvallis, Noah Chavez, KZI, 9 News.